Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Manufactured Opinion and today I wanted to bring you a few updates, maybe talk a little bit about Dragon's Dogma, some concerning things I've been reading on the interwebs about that. But before I get into any of that, I uh, just wanted to let you know that this is Witcher 2 Arena battling, um, fighting mobs, enemies, all that wonderful stuff. Uh, this is by no means a great showcase of skill and entertainment. <laughs> I just wanted to grab something real quick that I could talk over. Because I got a lot on my mind about, well, mostly about Dragon's Dogma. So yeah, I got a lot on my mind. Got some, got some updates. Mostly about games and videos you guys want to see. I will try to get that, get to that in the end of the video. But I may blabber on forever about Dragon's Dogma. But we'll see. So anyways, I've been reading a few things in Dragon's Dogma. And from what I've, well, lesson of the day. Don't believe everything you read. But, uh... These articles have direct quotes from an executive at Capcom, so I'm just going to go right into it. The game has on-disc on DLC, and before I even get into the whole DLC argument, um, I'm not against DLC. Stuff like Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas, Gears of War, although some of the Gears of War DLC was on the disc. Um, things like that, they, they provide you a lot of good stuff, good quality stuff. Um, you know they're not... <laughs> It's not just a cash grab. Um, and even a lot of the... You know, I shouldn't say that. A lot of DLC feels like a cash grab, but a lot of the times it doesn't too, like they provide you good quality content. So anyways, from what the gist I've been getting from articles on the interwebs is that if you've ever played um, a free-to-play browser game, and say, for example, you walk up to a treasure chest, and it says... Uh, pay twelve ninety nine to open this treasure chest and find this ruby, or pay fifteen dollars a month to open all the treasure chests. Like a little pop up in the game that tells you you can't access certain stuff, and if you pay a certain amount of money, you can get it. That's the vibe I'm getting from Dragon's Dogma. Now, saying that, I'm still willing to play Dragon's Dogma. I've hyped myself up for it so much, you know. <laughs> I really can't go back. I could stick it to the man. You know, give a big F you to Capcom. Um, but I'm a, I want to try it. I'm going to see what happens. You can call me a sheep. You can call me a douche. I don't know. Call me whatever you want. <laughs> but uh, I know a lot of people are going to be canceling their pre-orders. Uh, I know they're doing it right now. A lot of my friends are doing it right now. Um, I haven't had a lot of experience with, you know, on-disc on DLC. A lot of my friends have. They're sick of it. I can understand that sentiment. I totally respect that. I totally understand it. Um, but I just want to test it out. If It depends on what's behind the locked gates. Um, if there really is pop-ups, I just read this in an article. If it's a pop-up type style, like a free-to-play browser game, <laughs> I, I might just have to, you know, throw the game in the bottom of my game, bottom of my game pile and uh, wait for Capcom to uh, step up their game a little bit. But my question to you guys is, do you want me to make guides for that, noting all this stuff that um, it may not be as popular on release as it once was now that people are canceling all their pre-orders and shit. Um, noting that, do you guys still want me to make guides a, um, a la KOA to some extent Skyrim style like I've had on my channel? Uh, I'd really, I'm very interested to see your, um, your perspectives on that. Very interested indeed, because um, like I've said in numerous videos before, I don't want to waste my time and your time, and um, especially with a new release like Dragon's Dogma, you usually get a lot more views, so that would just, you know, light a fire under me making more Dragon's Dogma videos. So um, yeah, that that's that. Uh, let me know your thoughts. Um, some updates, I guess. Witcher 2 is still going strong. Um, I had some. I tried uploading a couple parts, and YouTube said the conversion failed. Uh, that kind of sucked because I missed uh, a few days in a row. Well, I missed two days in a row uploaded, then missed another two days in a row of uploading. So I, I had two or three videos I wanted to upload all at once, and YouTube failed. So I'm gonna try to do that again. I did upload one Witcher 2 um, playthrough this morning. As of, what's today, the 15th? Other stuff, other games you guys want to play, let me know if I'm going to be doing Dragon's Dogma. 
I'll obviously be um, I'll obviously have some Witcher 2 done so I can upload that at the same time as Dragon's Dogma so that wouldn't be a problem but if there's another game you guys want want me to play a lot of you have been requesting Minecraft 360 so uh, let me know about that other notes a lot of people have been asking for an IRL in in real life video we'll see we'll see about that setup videos have been requested uh, dual commentaries I don't know we may have to see but yeah leave me comments I love comments love reading them and take care everybody bye bye